Hey guys, so as promised, here is the Jesquel version 7.0. This is the DVD, the 1.5 gig DVD ISO. Uh, because it is bigger, it has a bit more, um, a bit more programs. Um, naturally, you have your again that beautiful document manager. It's not bad, it really isn't. Um, you have your internet, your web browser. Let's start that up. I believe this is a browser. Yep. Um, and it uses DuckDuckGo as usual. And we have the version number. It's 33. You have the privacy policy and user rights and license information from there. Um, feels like a version of Firefox, actually. I don't know. It might be, it might not be. Um, if you do know, let me know down in the comments. If Evolution Mail. Uh, pigeon. I've never been a fan of evolution. I kind of like um, the uh, Mozilla version, but eh, evolution works. Of course, your feed reader, your Bitcoin wallet, uh, remote desktop viewer, and your BitTorrent office. You have the Libre Office Suite. Do more than just write in a document. You can do um, Excel spreadsheets. Well, I guess this is the Libre Office Calc spreadsheets, but you know they're compatible. Um, Impress, you know your slideshows, your database drawing, stuff like that. Graphics comes with GIMP. GIMP is nice. Let's see how fast it'll load for us. I have 512 megs of RAM on this running. This is just this is not installed. It's just a that's not bad. That is pretty good. Um, this is a, a live CD or a live DVD. Um, the image viewer, again, you can scan documents. Sound, we have uh, videos, disk burner, the webcam, AUG convert. We can convert media files to free formats, see if an MP3 file or a so I'm going to get a screen recording and an MOV or MP4. wouldn't know who that would be <coughs> on a Mac. <coughs> yes, I use a Mac for my recording. Um, you can convert it to AUG. can create and edit movies. What is this? I've never seen this program. I used... Uh, used... Linux for a while now, but I've not I've not seen. Huh. Interesting. I have to do some edits on a video and see how well it comes out. Um. Of course, your music player and your sound recorder. You can sound record sound clips. Um. You got games, chess, mahjong, solitaire, mind, Sudoku. Just basic games, archive manager, calculator, all that fun stuff. Got screenshot themes, a screen reader, add remove themes, you got your system settings, um, background, all that type of stuff, tweak tool. So yeah, you can you can go in and change everything, uh, make sure it has everything that you the way you want it set up as usual. Um, you can just change your background. Go go into this screen. Um, your places, network, computer, things like that. Connect to a server. Log out, power off. So yeah, it's a, uh, it's not that bad of a program. Um, not that bad of a, of a distro. The, uh, I wouldn't mind installing that. Into. On a, on a laptop I own, actually. Um, 
one thing did I see? Oh, there's a terminal. Didn't think I had a terminal for a second, but no, they always come with a terminal. So, you know. Yeah. Not bad. Um, I want to say that this is... Um, just a, a good OS. And I should say that, because it is. Um, of course, I'd have to use it uh, for a long period of time uh, to, to test it out thoroughly. Um, if you can get through a month and of, of working with this, then you should be able to replace whatever you're using with it. Uh, let's say you get tired of Ubuntu, or you get tired of Windows. <laughs> Who wouldn't get tired of Windows? Or if you get tired of your Mac operating system, and you just want to go with free software, free as in speech, not free as in beer, then uh, this is one of your options you can go with. So yeah, not bad, not bad at all. Um, as a, I would give these uh, distros uh, an 8 out of 10. Um, do points matter though? I mean, it's it's up to you. If you want to use it, you use it, right? Yeah. Um, but yeah, it's uh, not bad of a distro. Not bad from what I've, from my first initial impressions of it. Um, I would, I'd definitely give it a shot. All right. Well, with that, we will uh, see you later. And uh, bye now.